Up until about a year ago, my life was pretty normal. I lived in the greatest place ever. Brooklyn, represent, had two cool parents, and loved all things science and superheroes. Everything changed, though, when my dad was killed in the city hall bombing. I, I couldn't believe he was gone. But Peter Parker and his Aunt May, they were there for me. And so was Spider-Man, who I later found out was Pete. Crazy, right? Then when the Devil's Breath crisis started, things got intense. It seemed like all of Spidey's villains were on the loose. I managed to do my part to help him out. And after all that, believe it or not, a spider bit me. And I started to change. I didn't want to worry my mom, so I went to Pete. And now, we're officially Spider Bros. He's been training me up, and I'm actually getting pretty good with this whole web swinging thing. I'm still learning to juggle this responsibility with everything else in my life. School, friends, a new home. I moved to Harlem a few weeks back. But I'll tell you, I can't wait to see what the future holds. Nada. My guy, you know? Yeah, I know. Hey, is Tails Bodega around here? Yeah, bright yellow sign down the block. Can't miss it. Thanks. Beautiful work, by the way. Maybe leave a little room for the new guy. Just in case. Miles, get 
Dad, you should get the shopping list. Hey, Mom. Uh, yeah, but uh, the bodega was out of coconut milk. I'm gonna check a store downtown. Oh, thank you. But avoid Midtown. That prison convoy is making traffic a nightmare. Oh, yeah. Good call. See you at dinner, Mom. Man, how does Pete do this secret identity thing? It completely stresses me out. Okay, be cool. Be cool. Helping Spider-Man protect the giant prison convoy? You can handle this. Breathe in, breathe out. Be cool. P. You here? Just down in some rocket fuel. How are you drinking? Very, very carefully. Okay, go time. Helix 2 en route, heavy payload. Copy, Helix 2, we've got you off scope. This is a big operation. It's gotta be. Hundreds of felons escaped from the raft last year. Now it's time to move them back in. Police aren't taking any chances, especially not with our guest of honor. Getting a lot of interference here. One of those guys who helped Doc Ock is in there? Think so. Could be Vulture, could be Scorpion, could be someone bigger. Okay, we got a problem. It's okay, we got this. Just need to contain it before... Before that happens. Hello, tiny spiders. Wow! Oh. 
police and escapees are shooting it out. Back up the police. I can hold out a little longer. He's counting on me. I gotta stop these guys. They're all over that bridge.
guys? Wow, just... <laughs> wow! Simon Krieger, head of R&D at Roxxon Energy. Pleasure to meet you. You too. Uh, sorry. I think our ball landed in your yard. No. Actually did us a favor. We uh, just bought the place. Uh, we're planning to tear it down for a build. But it uh, looks like you beat us to it. I wanted to thank you. Both of you. Taking down Rhino? Solo? <laughs> you are going places, bud. Thanks. But he, he's still dangerous. Nah, we'll hold him for the police. You know, I always think these super troopers are overkill until mm, something like this happens. Oh, duty calls. Hey, uh, really great to meet you both. <laughs> Future's looking bright. Hello. Hey. He's right. Yeah. Let's clear out. Let the police do their job. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Bioelectricity. Wow. Gotta be honest, a little jealous. Hey, look. I got nothing on the OG. Think we should run tests tomorrow? A little voltage analysis? Oh, man. Yeah, sorry. I've been meaning to tell you. I'm not gonna be around for the next few weeks. Is this some kind of pee joke I don't get? No. Uh, MJ's headed overseas for the Bugle and requested me as her photographer. Kind of a working vacation for us. Oh, man. Look, I don't know if I'm ready to fly solo. I screwed up today big time with the helicopter. But then you delivered big time. You saved my bacon, Miles. I got lucky. Hey, I did this gig for eight years without backup. And you better believe I screwed up lots of times. But that is how you learn. What's this? Christmas present. But first, you gotta take the oath. Oh. Um, okay. I promise to do everything in my power to protect this city. I promise. That's it? That oath a real thing. Totally. Definitely didn't just make it up. See you in a few weeks, Spider-Man. New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. Please don't screw this up. The city laid in the head of Pentacle. Shining on my brothers for long for those on the game. Form of pure evil's invisible, so I keep a lot of vision. Every night I try to read your mind. I see you, see your eyes. Oh, let me catch your eye. I won't waste any time. Cause all I wanna know is this. Oh, my thoughts open wide. Here it goes. Hold on, can I go? In this life, arms open wide. Yo, Genki! Dude! Rhino? What? Yeah. Where you at? You get into the apartment okay? Yeah. Your mom let me in. Unpacked slash dumped my stuff all over your floor. And now I'm in the park. Grab some air. Oh, perfect! Dip over to the amphitheater. Got something to show you. Dude, is this spider related? Please tell me you got a piece of Rhino's horn or something. Picks I've seen of the fight are straight up nuts! <laughs> Definitely spider related. And definitely better than a horn. Oh, loving the suspense. I'm there. Let's get to settle on Venus. We ran off with diamonds. The media mislead us. True wealth is knowledge. They will try to hold it down, but we gon' get back up right now. They gon' try to Genki's probably waiting at the amphitheater for me. I 
will never get used to you doing that. Hey, look. Check it. Christmas present from Spider-Man. Open it. Dude. Put it on. I'll cover you. What? Never seen a guy change clothes in Central Park? Okay. How's it looking? Whoa. Miles Morales, congratulations and welcome to your very first super suit. Head uptown for part two of this amazing gift. This is only half of the present. Well, what's the other half? I'll let you know when I find it. Welcome to Just the Facts with me, your truth slinging host with the most, J. Jonah Jameson. What? Does Pete said his suits the autoplay Jameson show? Guy's a masochist. Sad news, listeners. My Christmas charity spectacular was canceled due to masked vigilante mayhem. Gotta be something better on. Uh, been hearing good things about this one. Hello, I'm Danica Hart, and this is the Danicast, where I spotlight the people making a real difference in our city. Today's topic? Oh, you know, stockbrokers, for-profit colleges, maybe the people who make internet videos autoplay. <laughs> No, obviously we're covering the Spider-Man's incredible takedown of Rhino. Subscribe, Danicast, new favorite podcast. <laughs> this is the place. Looks like Pete set up a lot of gear. are spread throughout the city. Each one focuses on a new move or technique. This one focuses on acrobatic improvisation. Get into position to start. Hollow training? Oh, I am so down. First up, air combat. Fighting the enemy on your turns is a great way to gain the advantage. Now follow up with a mid-air attack. And now a personal favorite. The swing kick. This holotech is next gen. With the right parts, but I can make it portable. Another key spider skill, disarming. Parker. I've got something for you. Now let's combine these two moves. Invoking yeah. airborne enemies is a great method of crowd control. Plus, the sounds they make are hilarious. Woo! Yeah. Actually, you take this. Oh, 
combat status. Surprise round! Think fast! Alright, I'm feeling this! You're down! More guys incoming, heads up! Time for some free war practice. Use air combat and disarming to eliminate these enemies. high-tech gear we can sell. <laughs> oh, crap. Spider! <laughs> Take them out! Then grab the gear! Y'all trying to catch some hands? Yeah? Okay. Let's go. <clears throat> Take the spider out and grab the tech gear. Yeah. Gonna make bank selling this stuff off. Just so you know, uh, this is uh, official Spider-Man uh, tech. Uh, Y'all are not authorized to resell. Uh, 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 Fix a training sim. Critical fault on circuit AF 15. Colonel Panic. Well, let's try a BIOS reset. Nice! That did it. it. Looks like P made stealth, swinging, and combat challenges. Gotta check these out when I get a chance. Check out Roxxon Plaza on your way home. I just walked by and I'm pretty sure someone's breaking in. Uh, yeah. I'll look into it. Hey, so I want to hear more about your new spider powers. Think it's some kind of bioelectric discharge or supercharged static electricity? Ooh, we gotta name it. So, venom power. You know, because it stings. <laughs> okay, that's not bad. I'm gonna run. Plaza first, then home. Remember, Venom Power. Trust me, it's gold. Hey, friends. Thank you so much for telling people about this podcast. We've jumped the charts from 136 to 87. Like, uh, wow. <laughs> oh. 
Hi there, I'm Simon Krieger, and what you're standing next to is a new form reactor. Once activated, this reactor will supply enough energy to power all of Harlem. Now, I'm sure you're thinking, Simon, how is that possible? And the answer is new form. Just one canister of this revolutionary fuel source is enough to supply Harlem with clean, safe energy for the next 500 years. Soon, we'll be opening reactors throughout Manhattan, and then worldwide. Get ready for a planet powered by Nuvor. Roxxon, we're here for you. What was that? <clears throat> no sign of anybody. They broke a bunch of stuff. Maybe they were looking for something. Huh. They did a search for new form. What were they gonna do with <laughs> Man, this night will just not quit. Their tech is unbelievable, but Venom totally wrecks it. Yeah, Yankee's right. Venom's a good name. We'll hold it here. Everyone else. Before. Nice glow sticks. I slow them down if I use my new venom power. More of them up on the back. Yeah! 
Tinkerer? Who's that? Talking about new form shipments. I need to figure out what they found so I know where they're gonna hit next. They were tracking new form shipments, but why? Rocks on security. They can take it from here. Yeah. Gotta look into this later. Get home. Christmas dinner sounding pretty good right about now. I'll look into that group in the new form shipments tomorrow. Middle school graduation. Haven't seen these two in a while. What was that? All good. Little spill. Get it cleaned up real quick. All good. <laughs> it's all right, man. Ay, bendito. Mijo, qué guapo. <laughs> Gracias, mami. I invited a guest tonight. Can you get the apartment ready? Oh, um, maybe put on some music, set the mood? Ah, oh, Nadja. Really? Your campaign manager on Christmas Eve? Well, tomorrow's rally isn't going to plan itself. Thanks for getting the apartment ready, mijo. Hello? <laughs> okay, Nadja, ya nos dieron el permiso para mañana. Fifteen years in Brooklyn without a stain. Then we moved to Harlem. Might be a sign. Si, sí, claro. Glad Dad's tree survived the move. Me too. He loved that little guy. Ain't no Christmas like a Brooklyn Christmas. I miss hearing him say that. Él dijo que... No, no, no te creo. Ese hombre está Is loco. Is mystery guest Uncle Aaron? Un segundo. You know I don't want him coming around here. I just thought... Never mind. Let's talk about it later, okay? Nadja, I'm back. What else did you need me to do? Could you put on some music? Hey, I'm back. I shouldn't keep bugging mom. Seguro que sí. Como cuántos estamos esperando mañana? En serio? No records. Wow. Hey mom, where's dad's vinyl? Um, should be in my room. Thanks. No, no lo creo. Guess mom's not done unpacking either. That wallpaper just screams, Abuela. Well, what's that? Huh. Must have gotten mixed up in the move.
One of Dad's old case files. Who's the prowler? I wonder if Dad ever caught the guy. I haven't looked through these since before City Hall. Dad's favorite album. He put this on every Sunday while he made coffee. Salsa from Abuela. Mom and Dad would move when this came on. I think this was Uncle Aaron's. Dad never played it, but he also never got rid of it. Borax, borax with bleach. What's the pick, borax DJ? The greatest record ever. Haven't heard that one in a while. It was Uncle Aaron's. Oh, well, it's a great record. That doorbell's been broken for years. Miles, could you get that? Of course. How are your parents, Genki? I haven't talked to them in a while. They're good. They saw us. Finn? Hey. Fixed your doorbell. <laughs> it's so good to see you. How are you? It's been like... Months. A lot's changed. Yeah. It really has. Is that our guest of honor? Come on in, you two. Dinner's almost ready. Finn. I'm so glad you could make it. Thanks for inviting me, Miss Morales. <laughs> we missed you. Well, this one especially. <laughs> uh, hi. Finn, this is Genki, my friend from Brooklyn Visions Academy. Genki, this is Finn, my best friend. <laughs> my other best friend. <laughs> oh, yeah. You guys won the middle school science fair at County, right? You made a, uh... Energy, energy converter? converter? Jinx! <laughs> Oh. <sighs> the wiring in this building is such a mess. I'll check the circuit breaker. Gracias. So, Christmas by candlelight? I promise I didn't break it when I fixed your doorbell. I hadn't considered that. No good. Breaker doesn't have power. Looks like the whole block's out. Let me check if I can see anything from the fire escape. Okay, honey. But be safe. Definitely can't get to the transformer from here. Unless you're super sticky. Can you see any other buildings out? People on the roof. Can't go up there. Yeah, got the whole block. Really hope no one can see me up here. Which block's out of back? Oh. What's your problem? I don't know. Roxanne's customer service is crap. They kept me on hold two hours one time. Don't look out the window. Don't look out the window. Think Miles is having any luck outside? I hope so. Hot plates are only going to get so far south. Bioelectricity can take down Rhino. But can it save Christmas dinner? Come on. It worked. Oh man, those lights are bright. Did not think this through. Gotta get back inside ASAP. Distracted, Genki. Come on, Genki. Is Miles still outside? Actually, oh. uh, what about a photo? <laughs> right now? Yeah, you know, precious moments. You gotta capture them. Shouldn't we wait for Miles? No, he hates photos. <laughs> All right, everyone squeeze in. Ready? Great photo, great photo. Oh, hey, Miles. Uh, who's ready to eat? You guys sit down. I got this. Mm, smells good. Mm. <laughs> Everybody needs somebody. Everybody wants somebody to love. And I need you. And I need
<sighs> Finn, tell us everything you've been up to. You still in robotics club? I had to quit, but I've been studying biotech on my own. Nerd. Oh, says the guy who has to wear an ascot to school. <laughs> hey, only on Tuesdays. <laughs> Does your brother Rick still work for Roxon? I don't know how anyone could work there after seeing your last campaign ad. You went for Simon Krieger's jugular. <laughs> that reminds me. Genki, you have a certain flair for social media. Could you spread the word about tomorrow's rally? Yeah, we'll be trending by midnight. <sighs> Sometimes it feels like Simon Krieger's my real opponent. Roxxon has so much influence here, but they don't answer to anyone except their shareholders. Harlem needs someone to fight for the community. That's Mom's campaign speech voice, in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> uh, you want to proofread these before I post them? Yes! Do not hit send! <laughs> so, what's going on with you? What do you mean? You seem... I don't know. Distracted. Want to talk about it? Not tonight. It's Christmas. Hey, how are you handling the move from Brooklyn? I mean, it's fine. Ugh. You hate it. No. Nah. That's your, I hate it, but I'm too nice to say it voice. No, it's, I don't know anybody here. And I'm always having to ask for directions. You need to find a good restaurant. A barber shop, somewhere you can shoot hoops. You'll settle in. What if we hang out tomorrow? Just the two of us. You're not too busy? It's winter break. I can put off homework for at least another week. Okay, I'll text you. It's a date. I, I mean, n not a date, uh, you know, a, a friend date. Still as smooth as the last time I saw you. <laughs> <laughs> Miles. What? You awake? No. So I stayed up last night and designed an app for your new suit. Thing's got a crazy custom OS, nothing I've ever seen before. But I ran it through a disassembler so I could reverse engineer the plugin architecture and. Uh... <sighs> you just fell asleep again, didn't you? Miles! I'm up. I'm up. It's almost done compiling. Oh, thank you. Ready to try out my app? Yeah, man. Let's do this. I'm connected to your analytics. Let's test drive this baby. All right. I can see everything you see. How are you not puking all the time? Lots of practice. Welcome to Friendly Neighborhood 1.0. It lets New Yorkers directly request your help and report crimes in progress. Nice UI. Thanks. Oh, look, someone just made a request. The request came from a guy named Aaron Davis. Wait, what? That's my uncle. Does he know you're Spider-Man? No, gotta be a coincidence. Uh, I'm headed to the subway stop. Some help? 
I'm Spider-Man, by the way. Yeah, I know. Aaron Davis. I think somebody's messing with the sensors. I'm getting bad data from the main relay up top of Grand Central. On my way. Wait! Wait! Yeah? Where's the other Spider-Man? Oh, he's on vacation. But don't worry, I got this. <laughs> He definitely didn't recognize me. Oh, he's calling through the app? This is Spider-Man. Hey, forgot to mention. There was a break-in last night right next door at Roxanne Plaza. Group called the Underground. Caught him hanging around my stop this morning. The Underground? You know anything else about them? They think of themselves as a young mom. They've been around a while, but now they've got a new boss. Tinker. Tinker? Thanks for the tip. So, uh... You call Spider-Man often? Like, for help? <laughs> Didn't really have a way to get in touch to this app thing. But I saw you on the news last night taking down Rhino. Figured you were the right person to call. <laughs> cool. Have you, uh, been working at the subway long? Nah. Took the job last year after my brother. Well, anyway, I was trying to make some changes. Decided this job was a good place to start. Train going down on my watch doesn't exactly paint me in good life. Well, when we fix them, you can tell your boss you showed initiative by using the friendly neighborhood Spider-Man app. <laughs> I'll do that. Good luck with the sensors. the sensors. There are way too many wires on this one. It's got to be messing with the signal. Where do these cables go? Signal relays are being jammed by something. Hmm. This is crazy tech. Hate to do this, but... Sensors are back online. What did you do? took care of the guy messing with it. And it looks like they left some of their toys behind. Hey, I'm gonna have to call you back. Whoa. Bet I could use this to make those hollow drones Pete designed.
This tech has a pretty unique RF. I wonder if I can track it. Huh. It looks like there's a bunch more of these around this city. Trains are running again. Should check in with Uncle Aaron. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Davis. How are things looking now? I've got a signal, but new trains on the tracks. It must have gone down at the yard. It was the underground messing with your sensors. I'm thinking. Does Roxxon ever use the subway to ship new forms? Roxxon? Uh, the subway system was designed to carry people, not freight. This line got some updates from Roxxon Plaza. So they could be using it under the table. Hmm. I'll follow up on it. So, uh, you mentioned your brother. You got other family? Taking his job. I miss him. Especially my nephew. We used to mix beats together. Well, maybe now you can see him again. Zen, your family. Oh, so. Yeah. Uh, I should go. Fight underground. Bye.
underground's wrecking everything. Maybe I can stop them quietly. Hurry it up! Take Gotta split those guys in and out quick. This stuff takes time, man! What was that noise? Time to try a piece. Nice. Now I can track them. I heard something. It's Spider-Man! One down. I've got a theory. We're trying to intercept new form. Am I close? That's all of them. Now to get the trains back on the tracks. Controls are probably in the office. Tinkerer. 
Monk said that's their leader. <coughs> oh, man. They read the controls. Gonna have to get the trains back on the tracks by hand. Web. I can use that turntable. Spin the turntable, pull trains with webs. Should work. Works. Almost there. I need to get in front of it. Aaron sounds serious about wanting to get back in the family. I should reach out to him. As Miles. My dad never talked about what happened between them. Must have been bad. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Now for the others. Underground looks like new form shipments, and then kills the subways. Maybe they're trying to stop new form from reaching the city, or... What? That's right. Yes. Okay, one more. Up there. Need to get it to stay down. Come on, Miles. Stick the gears. Train, then whip up the pulley. Should be good to go. It worked. We've got trains on the tracks. Now they need power. Hmm. Huh. <sighs> 
they busted the controls here, too. But not the generator. Okay, I can use that to power the trains. Probably. My webs are conductive. <laughs> 